Women FC TV with Adam Hinchwood following a 4 0 win over Eastbourne Borough in the National League South. Couldn't start the new year in a better way, Adam. What performance? No, it was um, like from start to finish, I thought, um, you know, credit to the players, they was really together working hard um, and put everything into to the game. And, um, you know, I've been, been saying to you for a while now that um, when we do that, and we're together and we look like a real team uh, out there today. Uh, when we do that, we're, we're a tough, tough team to play against. And um, it's nice to see one or two playing with a bit more confidence now. Um, it just felt like when they can get confident in this group, um, you know, they are a real, real um, tough team to play against, like I say, and it's, it's excellent and a pleasure to watch. It was, it just looked like from the start of the boys exactly what they wanted do they were 100 percent on their game the effort the work rate was all there and it's everything you've been wanting from the team these away performance that hasn't quite been there you must have been so satisfied to see it all come together today no it certainly was um and yeah we've been saying for a while the performance has been good um even in some of our heavy defeats away from home the the 45 minutes and 50 minutes of it has been very good so to put it all together today um keep back-to-back -back clean sheets as well um you know Bocco's played really well and you know we've got a goalkeeper coming now as well to give him a bit of competition and to up his game um, which you know is, is good timing I think um, and yeah just the whole it's, it's just everyone sort of coming together Jake's coming back in minutes and Luke he was looked a real threat again when he come on um, so yeah you go through the whole team today the, the, it was a team team effort and even the, the subs and everyone it just feels like there's a bit more of a togetherness now and yeah, I think you've seen that on the pitch 100% I mean I think the third goal was a perfect example of that Ricky's from the edge of the box the little dummy beforehand that presence of mind knowing where your teammates going to be to set that sort of chance up perfect worthing goal it was yeah and I thought the counter attack the fourth one was was an unbelievable goal as well and um, yeah uh, like I know when I look around that change room you've got a lot of talent staring back at me um, and then if we can get that togetherness and that work ethic like they showed today um, then you know we've got a real good team on our hands and now it's down to us to, to maintain our standards um, I've been saying now can we put a little run together um, of, of um, you know results as well as performances uh, I think performances have been good for a while now but now it's time to really knuckle down and get some results uh, together yeah, in a busy period as well with January, so a good opportunity to do that going home next Saturday against Chelmsford. Looking out there today, though, who do you reckon was the man who stood out for you? Performances were excellent, but who do you think really stood out? Um, I think like Greg was excellent today. Um, back to back now, good performances from him and Michael. Um, I think the you know others have maybe been doing it for a consistent basis, but you know, them two have put two good uh, back to back performances. Michael was was ill as well and you know showed a battling sort of um, spirit and um, yeah I thought uh, Greg's sort of got to get in his mind that he's playing against Eastbourne Borough every week because uh, you know he can be a real real powerful and a real top player for us um, so yeah those two were, were particularly good again um, but the rest have been you know, quite good now for, for a number of games so um, it's, it's, it's a real team, team performance and um, so really I um, just felt we trained Saturday and just felt a little tweak in his hamstring so um, didn't want to take any risk with today. Um, don't think it's going to be anything too sinister. Hopefully the rest today we'll see him back for, for next Saturday um, and available. So yeah, like I say, it's, it's good. There's um, real good squads coming together. Um, coming back and um, if we can get one or two uh, a little bit fitter um, we'll be in a really good place.